The laboratory of Professor Thomas Jensch has discovered and investigated proteins which help to transport charged particles like potassium and chloride ions across membranes. These proteins are important for establishing voltage across cellular membranes or establishing the ion concentrations within cells and are involved, for instance, in signal transduction in the brain and in transport of salt and water in the kidney. We have shown that several of these proteins are mutated in human diseases, which affect several organ systems like the kidney, the brain, inner ear, or muscle. For example, intracellular membrane-bound organelles called lysosomes need a high level of acid to degrade foreign material and defective proteins. If this degradation is impaired, these lysosomes accumulate foreign material and this results in a disease called lysosomal storage disease. This disease is often associated with neurodegeneration and sometimes with osteopetrosis, which is a bone disease. Building up acid in lysosomes requires a pumping of positively charged hydrogen ions into their interior. Normally this process would stop because the pumping of positive charge would generate a voltage which would inhibit further pumping. It was assumed for a long time that the positive charge is balanced by the transport of negative charge, namely chloride. However, Jensch's lab has discovered a protein called CLC7, which is responsible for the chloride uptake. If CLC7 worked the way people have thought, knocking it out in mice should lower the level of acid in lysosomes. But strangely enough, when we measured pH in lysosomes in our mice, the level of acid was normal. Therefore, we now think that the problem in these mice is not the different level of acid, but rather of chloride, and we have just generated a mouse model which really supports this idea. Now scientists are trying to find out what chloride is really doing in lysosomes. This work really changes our view of the function of lysosomes and also of other compartments named endosomes, which deliver material for degradation to lysosomes.